subscribe right now and hit the bell icon, or this fat spider will crawl over your face while you sleep. Ah! Today, we will be showcasing the top 10 strangest last meal requests on death row. While some of these can be quite humorous, with some inmates asking for literally just an olive and nothing else, others can be downright disturbing to say the least. Be sure to stick around for the number two pick because that one is surely going to shock you. But anyways, with that being said, let's start this off with number 10. A lump of dirt. You may think that high quality dirt is a good addition for any gardening enthusiast, but that's not the case here for James Edward Smith. Having been charged of both robbery and murder back in 1983, it seemed quite hard to believe that this type of person would have such a strange sense of humor. But to everyone's surprise, the reason behind the choice was even more ridiculous than anyone would have guessed. He actually wanted the dirt so he could mark his body and thus make sure that he wouldn't become a vengeful ghost after his untimely death. Needless to say, he was rejected and instead given yogurt. Number nine, a flask of Jack Daniels. Alcohol can be quite bad for your health if you consume it in excess. But when you're on death row, not many people will actually tell you that to say the least. That certainly wasn't the case for John Speckelink, a convicted murderer and robber that was sentenced to death back in 1979. When asked what he would like for his final meal, he stated that he didn't care about special food altogether, asking instead for a simple flask of Jack Daniels to get wasted before his injection. Many argued that this shouldn't be allowed, but to this day, the state of Florida has yet to refuse alcohol from their death row inmates. Number eight, a cup of black coffee. Eileen Wernens was sentenced to death in 2002, but to one surprise, her final request was nowhere near as luxurious as many would have thought it to be. She basically just wanted a single cup of black coffee. Famously saying, don't even think about killing me before I've had my morning coffee. Known as America's first female serial killer, and her final request definitely mirrors that to a T. Number seven, nothing. This story comes to us from 1989, where Ted Bundy, one of the world's most famous serial killers of all time, denied any food being given to him before he got sent to the electrical chair. He confessed to the murder of 30 women, but officials believe the number is to be way bigger than that, since Ted was famous for lying his way out of any situation. So what happens when you deny your final meal? You are given a simple plate of steak, eggs, hash browns, and coffee. But being the picky eater that he was, he refused to eat any of that. Number six, pizzas for the poor. This is quite a strange request to say the least, but it happened in May 2009 in Nashville as Philip Workman was sentenced to death for killing a police officer. Instead of having his meal go to waste on himself, he decided to give away his vegetarian pizza to the homeless. Needless to say, his request was denied in no time. But the locals were so impressed by the gesture that they ended up making the pizzas anyway and giving them away to the homeless for him. Number five, a cup of tea and cookies. John William Elliott was convicted of rape and capital murder back in the late 80s. And as he was asked what he would want for his final meal, he simply said a cup of tea and six whole cookies. The thing we have to ask here is why on earth would he eat six whole cookies as his final meal? If you know you're going out that very day, why not just go for 100 and really put a dent in the prison's budget while you're at it? Then again, he wasn't the smartest person to begin with. Number four, cheese doodles and Coke. You may think this is the preferred meal of a 12 year old, but this wasn't the case for Velma Barfield, the 52 year old serial killer that confessed to a total of six murders over the years. As she was preparing for the lethal injection that she chose as her death sentence, she merely asked for a Coke and cheese doodles. Hopefully she didn't leave out any cheese dust in the prison cell bars. We wouldn't want to inconvenience the convicts that will live out their final moments there, now would we? Number three, room temperature spaghetti. We are not joking about this. Thompson Grayso really did ask for room temperature spaghetti, and he was very serious about it too. It is said that as his meal arrived, he started complaining about how the spaghetti was too hot and he couldn't be asked to eat it that way. Many officials have stated, however, that his actual final meal was much more elaborate, but that the person listening to his request wasn't paying attention. So instead of a lengthy list, which ended in a room temperature spaghetti hose, he was given a single plate of warm spaghetti. Number two, a child. This came out in 2014 as Stephen K. Walker, a famous convicted cannibal, is said to have actually requested a literal child as his final meal. Many dispute this, however, saying that this was all made up as a joke by a satirical website known as Hip Hop Hangover. But let's be honest here. If he was actually to be given anything he could ask for, he surely wouldn't have asked for any normal piece of steak. Now would he? 
Number 1. A Single Olive Victor Harry Fegger was sentenced to death in 1963 for kidnapping Dr. Edward Bartlett's and eventually killing him off with a pistol. Although he wasn't all that famous of a murderer when he was first sentenced, his name does tend to linger around the online communities, mainly because of his strange final request, which consisted of a single olive. With his belly full, he headed straight for the noose, becoming Iowa's last person sentenced to death in that state. As terrifying as these people may be, we can't help but laugh at their ridiculous final meal requests. Share with us what you'd like as your final meal in the comments below, and be sure to hit the subscribe and like button too. Now as for our last request, click on the videos on the left and right side of your screen. Thanks for watching, see ya!